In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix this error call account action required. So basically this happens when someone change your Google or Gmail password or they have been removed your device from the trusted device list. To fix this error, basically you can follow three steps. First, you can re-enter your login details and log back into your account. If you can't log back into your account, instead of login, you have to recover your account. But if you can't log back or if you can't recover your account as the third option, if you don't need this account to your device anymore, basically you can remove this account from this device. So first, I believe you still need this account. So you want to log back into an account by fixing this either. So I will type down to the notification bar. Then I will tap on this error message. Just tap on that message. Then you will get this check-in info, then you will get this verify it's you message. So to log back into account, tap the next button, then they ask you to enter your password. Here, they ask you to enter the recent password. But if someone changed your password, you can't log back into a account. You have to recover it like this. I will try out my password. When I try to log back, it says my password has been changed. So Instead of logging back to my account, I have to recover it. To recover my account, there are basically two ways. Either you can use this application or you can use your default web browser. First, I will show you how to do that thing just using this application. So if you got this kind of window, just tap, try another way. Then they will show or they will provide deeper an option. Here, they ask you to use a passkey. If you don't have anything, just tap get help or try another way to log in. Then it will show all possible recovery methods one after another. Like this, they ask you to use another device. If you can't use another device, just tap try another way. By the way, I want to tell you, if you have access to any of these recovery method, I ask you to select that method and get a recovery link then easily you can log back into an account like this one. If you already added a recovery phone number, you can select that. Then they will send a one-time recovery code via SMS. But unfortunately, if you can't get uh, any verification or any SMS, you have to tap try another way option in the bottom left corner. Like this, if you go forward, it will show deeper and deeper an option. Like this, get a verification code to your recovery email address. So if you already added some recovery email address, they will list out and you can get a recovery link. But unfortunately, if you don't have any of these recovery method, or if you couldn't answer any of these recovery method, you will get this kind of error message. If you got this kind of error message, don't worry, we can fix this error. In this video, I will show you a simple trick to fix this error. But if you get in this error again and again, I invite you to watch the full video. You can find that full video in this video description. Go and check it out if you face any problem. But I will show you a simple trick. Type down the notification bar. Then if you are using your mobile network, you can switch to familiar Wi-Fi network. Then. Like this, you can connect to that family Wi-Fi network. Then you can turn off your mobile data as well as I recommend you to turn on your location permission. Then Google tracks the location that you try to recover your account. Then if they could verify you are the real owner, they will allow you to recover your account. As well as it is better if you can use a device that you used to log into your Google account before. But if you can't find out any older device, Let's move to the second recovery method. In this method, I will try out using a mobile browser. Here, you don't need to use the same browser, just open your default web browser. After opening, go to search bar, then type and search how to recover your Google account. Then you want to see the very first search result. After getting this search result, you scroll a little bit down. Under forgot your password, you have to tap this blue color link recover your Google account or Gmail. Here, you will get this account recovery page. In here, they ask you to enter your Gmail or phone number. Enter your hacker email ID. You can enter 
with at gmail.com or without at gmail.com. Like this, I will enter my Gmail ID and tap the next button. Then they ask you to enter your password. If you don't have any password, you can tap try another way. If you remember any of your last password, you can try out that one. Then it will show all recovery method one after another. I highly recommend you to select at least one verification or recovery method. Using that recovery method, easily you can get a verification code. After that, you can recover your account. Here, if you don't have access to any of these, just tap try another way to sign in at the bottom. Then you will get alternative option. Here, you can use either fingerprint, face or your screen lock. I highly recommend you to select at least one of these verification method. Then you will get this welcome back window and you can recover your account really easily like this. But unfortunately, if you couldn't recover your account using this method, I highly recommend you to watch the full tutorial in the description. Then I will show you the final option. If you don't need this account on your device, basically you can remove this account from your device. For that, you can open any Google application. After that, if you got this kind of pop-up message, just tap cancel. Then tap the profile icon in the top right corner. Then in the pop-up window, you have to select this one, manage account on this device. Then you can see all the account that on your mobile. Here, you have to remove the account that you don't need anymore. Here, I will select this Gmail ID. Then tap the remove account button. In the pop-up window, you have to tap remove account too. But instead of removing this account from your device, still you want to recover it, I invite you to watch the full recovery video in the description or you can click this end screen video and come on over. So that is today's tutorial. See you in the next one. Later.